We're searching for two fugitives, Jason Morgan and Sam McCall. I don't Jason, see anyone in medical and I'm shot, so you need to come with me and help me, please. Hi. I'm begging you. Dr. Quarterman. Excuse me, I need to talk to you about your son. Take care of it. I'll take care of it. Let's get him on the bed. Come on. It's all right. Oh, sorry. You see? Just a little bit more. Come on. There you go. Easy. Easy, Jason. Thank you. Thank you for doing this. I am your mother, Jason. Of course I'm going to take care of you. No one followed us. I was careful. Sammy took, he took a big risk. Yeah, well, I wasn't going to let you die. I could tell the internal damage is minimal. But he runs a very, very high risk of infection, and he should be in a hospital. I told him. Yeah, I know. Well, but he's strong and he's in good health, so with with medication and rest, he should recover. Well, he's passed out. I, I'm, I'm kind of glad he's passed out. He was in so much pain. I really thought he was going to start to cry. <laughs> Isn't it weird, though, how... When someone you love is injured, you, you want to take the pain away for See, them. You did just fine. You were very helpful. Oh, you saved his life. And I will owe you forever for that. Not that my gratitude matters, because he's your son, and you love him, and you would have saved his life anyway, so yes. I don't know. Yes. He is my son, and I love him. And obviously, you do, too. You know, I have never felt like this about anyone. Before, Jason believed in me when no one else would. He risked his life for me. You know, I would do anything for him. Turn yourself in? Turning myself in is the only way to save Jason. I'll call the cops right now. Don't. Let's give him time to pull through on his own. You were testing me, weren't you? I'm trusting my son's life with you. I need to know if he would put his welfare ahead of yours. He's really lucky to have you as a mother. Jason can be a very difficult person. Cold and unfeeling on the outside. but truly devoted to those that he loves. Oh, I have to go. Make sure he takes one of these every four hours. Because if that one gets infected, he could be in a lot of trouble. Are you going to come back and check? Oh, yeah. I'll be back tomorrow. I'll bring more medicine, but in the meantime, make sure he stays quiet. He doesn't get up, even if he says he's okay. okay. Right. <laughs> Got it. I'm glad he has you in his life. Sam. Hey. How do you feel? I feel better. <laughs> You're a liar. We, we gotta get out of here. No, 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 no. Lay mm -hmm. back. Mm -hmm. Your mother had to leave, but she said that you need to rest. And you need to listen to me, doctor's orders. Thank you. You should sleep now, okay? Oh. 
like you should do. I will. I will. After you, I, um, I'm getting pretty tired anyway. I'll just, there's room on the bed. You no, can no, 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 no. I don't want to hurt you. I'll sleep on the Sam, floor. please. Please. I guess this is the real kidnap. 